In this video, we are going to take a detailed look at how Solve Finance has become the pioneer for financial NFTs, using its own Solve vouchers as an example. If you haven't watched our previous video on VNFT, you can do so in the link below. Empowered by the VNFT token standard, Solve Vouchers is a decentralized application for creating, managing, and trading allocation NFTs, which are to become a new asset class for financial NFTs in the world of DeFi. For this video, we will be specifically looking at how vouchers can be used as lockup allocations for projects and how it solves liquidity problems in the process. Our Solve vouchers are splittable, composable NFTs that lock a certain amount of tokens and unlock according to a program vesting schedule. That means our vouchers can be deemed as a semi-fungible asset which can be combined when they share the same lockup period as well as lockup mode and same underlying asset type. You can split your voucher into multiple parts and auction each off individually on a platform like OpenSea. To mint a voucher, projects go to solve.finance and deposit accepted assets into the smart contract. Once the tokens are locked, projects will get the voucher as an NFT to represent the locked allocations just deposited in the smart contract. Not only can projects and teams freely convert assets into vouchers on Solve, but they can also choose how their lock allocations get distributed through the smart contract. For now, your options are linear, which means they will get released based on the block height, staged, which allows you to release chunks at a specific period of time, or as a one-time release, with a date also set by you. Regardless of which release schedule you choose, you will be able to set the maturation date of the voucher, ensuring that the assets within are released when you want them to be.